Hello there, uh, person watching this video. Have you ever wanted to see a true old TDS game? None of that TDS arc. <coughs> Anyways, as I was saying, uh, none of that uh, TDS archives. No, no TDS 2019. No, oh nice, Teletubbies on Netflix. No RTDS! Why are there ghosts in the background? Who did that? <coughs> Anyways, you get to see um, the modern overhaul mega. And, of course, like all TDS games, pre mega. You look. So you can see, you press the start. Gives you a list of things about the update, why it's added. This is not currently scripted, but just so you know, uh, the boss free was not in the first update. So you press this, it would go to V.1.0.1, which adds the uh, boss free. Now, uh, you can press play, <coughs> but we're not gonna do that yet. My last thing I'd like to show you is chaos mode. Uh, I'm at custom modes. Uh, we're gonna have some custom modes. This is just chaos mode, and I cannot press this. It's because um, I'm lazy and I did not add the um, thing yet. Information. <coughs> the only thing important here is one thing I like to add is that any microtransactions here are not real. Okay, they're not real. Don't ban me. Here are the people who helped make the game. Is that a uh, slasher? Holy shit. Slasher. <coughs> Anyways, let's begin. The start. So you see uh, this guy, this guy is the person who made the map, he's a very cool dude. Not really anything to do here, except watch this. Boom. Let's go back. If you do decide to play this, the button to do that is right shift. Let's go see Foth. A lot more, uh, you know, detailed. Uh, also, don't worry about the statues. Those are going to definitely be changed in the future. If they're like, uh, anything that like, you know, shows credit to, uh, the people who made the game. Of course, that's why the credit section is there, by the way. Gonna try to make this as accurate as possible, so we're just gonna uh, we're gonna replace that with below natural as much as I hate it because below natural is a loser. <coughs> Anyways, uh, let's keep going. Uh, hold on. Here is the beach. Yeah, that's the door. Nothing about the door really. As you can see, everything is Bobloxia, Bobloxia, Bobloxia. <coughs> We're gonna climb up here. I forgot what the right way is, but you can definitely escape the lobby. I'm gonna try to. Uh, and this, this, this should be the right way. Yep, this is the right way, I think. Hell yeah. Yeah! No! Wait, I found it. Never mind, we escaped. As you can see, here's an asset for the elevators. 
It's just something you can just copy and paste and all. Yeah, yeah. Anyways, on to the next one. Now, oh my god, I forgot I had this. Forget those place, except for this one. This one is cool. But forget those placeholder images in this one. You can not ignore this one. This one's cool. Let's forget all the gadget life there was there. We're not going to talk about that. <coughs> I don't know who added it, but it was not me. Anyways, uh, here's Area 51. Uh, I've been trying to make the GUI accurate, so it's, it's, a, it's a bit wonky in my opinion. But we got button sounds now. As I've seen, the more and more lobbies he makes, the more higher quality it is. While the uh, mega update thing is not done yet, the autumn lobby is not done yet. Uh, <coughs> I can show a picture of it. It's um very high quality. It's just getting better and better somehow. Yep, here is area 51. And hopefully, if I get this right, uh, we can delete area 51. Come on, I got this. Yeah, elevators, area 51. Damn, wait, oh my god, yes, it's working. We got this, man. I hopefully can destroy area 51. Oh my god. Elevator. Uh, print, hold on. I got this. Just wait for my hacker man abilities. No! I want the names, loser. <coughs> this is so trash. Oh, what about if we do the remote? All I have to say is the Seafoth one is definitely down there. Maybe we can try escaping, as I know you can escape like this lobby too. You can escape everything in this game, I'm not even kidding. We can climb the UFOs, I hopefully I, we can. I hope we can climb the UFOs. What about... Tommy turned off. I thought he turned off collision. This, this game sucks. Return to lobby. <laughs> now, let's do a, um. A brief. Brief, very brief, uh. Show of the game. The start. Let's enter the elevator now. Uh oh, it's not good. Go buy. I found trick or treat candy. Well, let's go.
What a clutch. <clears throat> this is definitely far from done. This uses gnome code scripts. Anyways, uh, the scouts are damaging. I just removed the health bars. Get everything for free. Sniper is a god. He doesn't even have to look, and he's just straight up killing you. Sniper. Soldier is hacking. Soldier is hacking too. Pyromancer is just Pyromancer. I don't know. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Oh my god. What is he? Well, if you get put next to Pyro Zero, you're dead. Look, bro. Yeah, this. No, no, no. I forgot. Pyromancer can damage enemies too. I'm gonna try to get the soldiers to attack. They just gotta be like far enough and no side to attack. Oh my god. Also, don't even try looking at the clients. Broken. Oh my god, bro. I want to see Power Mancer. My soldier fire. I want to show case a soldier. This guy sucked. Yeah, from what I'm seeing, a soldier is not going to work. Yeah, sorry. <clears throat> yeah, guys, I'm definitely gonna need some people to help me script things. So if you wanna help with that, check the link in the description, would you please? Anyways, it's time to go on to the next game mode. Also, I'd rather not spend 2,000 hours trying to get a fucking file on the map. Mac computers suck. They have little space. The only reason this one has so much space is because I've downloaded nothing but like two gigabyte, two kilobyte images. Now, the final one. Chaos mode. Of course, I was too lazy to add the, would you like to return the lobby? Here's a cool guy. He's made none of the music for this game, but some of the music for the other game. Don't place down the green mini. Only place the blue scout at the edge. <coughs> anyway, uh, the enemies, don't blame me for the, the first enemy. Because I swear, one of the developers added that. I hate it personally, but every developer got to add an enemy of their own. Okay? <clears throat> I don't know. I'm never gonna do that again. This first enemy was made by, of course, you can see the guy over there. Definitely him. Or unless it was someone else. Like, I don't know. I'll keep forgetting. Because they keep changing. Alias. Anyways, uh, place it down. Shit. Spam scouts. Spam scouts. Here they come. Here they come. Here they come. We're not going to place the blue scout yet. It's not really good. Uh, so let's see what happens if you place the green mini. Let's see what happens. 
I don't care what that guy says. She's the person who makes a stupid girl. Oh! Oh crap! Oh crap! No! Oh no! 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 This game sucks. Why? I I hate green mini gunner so much. I'm never gonna place this guy down ever again. No, 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 no. Anyways, that's gonna be um. Hold on. Anyways, that's the end of this video. Remember, if you want to help on this game, join the server in the description. Um. Unlike, unsubscribe, and unclick that bell.